Hi guys, me Melissa. How are you? Today is November 8th, time for our daily draw. And today I'm going to be using the Spirit of Animals Oracle by Judy Bergson. Bergsma. Let's open this box. I love this deck. And I was, it's such a beautiful day today. Uh, it's going to get up to 60, I think they said, or close to 60. So for some reason, animals were just calling out to me because um, the animals are starting to come out. Um, I noticed today uh, my crocuses are out. Uh, I have yellow ones, white ones, and purple ones. So I'm going to go out and take some pictures of those in a little bit once it gets a little bit warmer out. I think it's about eh, around 40-ish right now in the 40s. Um, so it's still a little bit chilly. Um, so I want to wait until it gets a little bit warmer out. So these cards, here are the backs. Love, love, love this deck. This is one of my favorite animal oracle decks that I own. And I don't think I'm going to be able to shuffle these. No, my hands won't fit around these cards. So we're just going to this way. Angels, guides, and spirits. Tell us what my viewers need to know today. November 8th of 2020. And that one just went flying. So that must have been a really important one. Okay. Angels, guides, and spirits. Is there anything else you would like to tell us for today? Nope, I guess that's it for today. So let me pick this card up off the floor that went just to fly it. We have moose for wisdom. Ugh, let me slide back up here. Sorry, guys. I've been having a lot of problems with this camera thing the last couple days. Okay, so it says, let your head and your mind reach to the stars, yet keep your feet grounded on earth. Listen to the ancient wisdom in your soul. The ancestors speak through you. You know much. So there is our moose. It's a beautiful card. All right, let me find moose in here if I can do it with one hand here. Yep. Okay. So, the moose's key words are accomplishments, opportunity, self-esteem, worthlessness, greatness, majesty, wisdom for the elders, instinct, honor, longevity, steadfast, and fearlessness. The moose is a powerful totem. It is a unique energy with many contradictions. Awkward yet graceful and plain but beautiful. Moose, it, moose are masters of wisdom and perception. In spite of their large size, they are swift, confident, and fearless. Moose people always have a strong presence. Their totem stands seven feet tall with a crown of antlers almost as wide. Their antlers are said to act as antenna to the secrets and teachings of the wise one. If moose is your totem, you are a majestic and sit in the council of your ancestors. You are smart and outstanding in your field. You are intuitive and from an early age, you have experienced connections to spirit that have eluded others. You are a strong survivor. Moose lives a strong life. Your lofty heights are not for many, but for few. With moose as a totem, you are sure to travel 
the long winding path to your destiny, wisdom, and mastery. So this is for our self-esteem. Um, it is for our intuitive side. It is for our um, strong presence that we feel that um, we need to feel for um, our spirit animals. Um, it's for long life. It's for longevity, um, greatness. So all that is in our future. All that opportunities, uh, you know, are coming. Accomplishments. We have so many things that we should be grateful for and so many things that we have accomplished in our lives. And we have to recognize the things that we have done good. The things that we um, know that we are going to be doing good or that we need to do good. So that's what this message is about. And I hope this resonates with all of you. Some of these readings might not resonate with you, but keep um, listening because they are going to resonate um, at a point or another. But um, hopefully this resonates with everybody. So just keep looking for those opportunities. Remember, we have opportunities. We've had opportunities and the things that we should be grateful for and the things that we have accomplished in life. Okay, guys, I love you. I hope this helps. Enjoy this beautiful, beautiful day um, in New York. If you're in New York, I'm not sure how it is in the rest of the um, the United States or abroad. Um, but today here in New York, it's going to be 60 degrees and beautiful sunny. So I love you guys. 